everybody welcome back to my channel i have scentsy mail today so i picked up a couple of the newest collections so we have mulan and we also have the easter collection and i promise you my box smelled good as soon as i cracked it open i hadn't even took the stuffing off the top yet and it just smelled great so i am super excited so we're going to start off with Mulan. I'm going to show you where you can find it at. So I'm on my website and I'm just going to go to the drop down. If the drop down will pop up. And we're going to go to collections. And that's going to open up. And we're going to go to Disney's Mulan. And we're going to click that. And that's also going to have the notes, so I can go ahead and read you the description of the notes after I get done sniffing everything out. So here's what's available. You have the Buddy that's available, Mushu. You have the scent pack. It comes with a scent pack, but you can also get another scent pack separately. And then we have the wax bar. So I just decided to get the wax bar, so... We're going to sniff together and see what this smells like. I'm excited. So, first of all, the packaging, really, really pretty. So, let's check it out. Okay, this is, it smells like a grapefruit. I know there's something that's kind of like a citrusy type of note in this. Um, I know it's probably not grapefruit, but that's the first thing I'm smelling. I'm trying to get this to pop out so I can smell it from the bottom. It's kind of spicy. It's like a spicy, it's like a spice grapefruit. That's what it's reminding me of. Hmm. You guys know I'm not a citrus person, so... But I'm willing to give it a shot. So let's see what Scentsy says the notes are for this one. So Scentsy says, Feed your guardian spirit with sweet papaya nectar, juicy mango, and a delicate touch of red ginger flower. So you've got a lot of citrus going on here with your papaya, your mango, and then it the zing of that ginger so it is that that's where the spicy is coming from is that ginger note this is very spicy zingy zesty but as i said i am willing to give it a warm because as we always know things can smell very different warm than on cold sniff and back to the collection that I was super excited for, and that is the Easter collection. So from what I have heard, this collection came around before, back in the day, before I was a consultant. And it is now back. I have never smelt it, so I'm super excited. So we're going back to the collections tab. And we're going to go straight here to the Easter collection. Ah! Oh, it worked. Look at that. So here is the Easter collection. It is a three-pack right here. And it's $17 for the three-pack. You can also get the mystery um, buddy clip. And it's either going to be a chick or a bunny and I've heard a lot of people have been getting a lot of one or a lot of the other. I didn't decide to get the bunny clip. I just decided to get, did I say bunny clip? Buddy clip. I just decided to get the wax. So, as I said, it is $17 for the three wax bars. And I have two favorites. So, I'm going to go ahead and smell the first one first that might turn into a favorite but right now it's not on my favorites list and that is rockin ruby rass 
Okay, so as I said, I'm leaving my two favorites last. So we're going to start with Rockin' Ruby Raz, and we're going to see what it smells like. It does smell like raspberry. Duh. Um, from what I have heard, people say this smells like a fruit punch. So I do kind of get that. This does not want to pop out. I do get that fruit punch note off of it right off the top. This isn't coming out, so we're just going to do it like that. I can smell raspberry a little bit. It's more of a fruit punch. I like it. I don't love it, but I like it. Okay, Rockin' Ruby Raz. A lot of people were excited that this came back. It's a fan favorite, so... Uh, let's see what Scentsy says that this smells like. It says, birthday parties and punch bowls presents... Presents. Reading is so fundamental. Let's start this all over again. Birthday parties and punch bowls and presents piled high. This fruity blend of juicy orange, fresh strawberry, and sweet candy glaze is a child's best day all wrapped up in one perfect fragrance. Ooh, that is a long scent description. I'm just saying that was long. But, yeah, really the fruit punch note off of this is predominant. So if you love a fruit punch smelling anything, this is the one you want. Okay, it's hard to decide between these two which is going to be the favorite. These two are already in my Scentsy Club. I put them in sight unseen just because of the notes, the fragrance notes. But I think I've already heard about this one, and I'll explain what's going on. I think this is going to be the favorite, so we got to leave the best for last, right? So let's check out Cotton Candy Cookie. Okay, cotton candy cookie, like I said, already in my Scentsy Club, according to the notes and seeing a couple of videos and hearing everybody's excitement for these, I'm excited. So, this is nice. It's different. It is like a sweet cookie. It's very strange. It's... It's strange in a good way, don't get me wrong, but I heard this was like uh, cotton candy, well, duh, it's cotton candy cookie, so I've heard that it really does smell like cotton candy and cookie, and you're kind of racking your brain like, how does this work? But it does work because it smells like a sweet cookie. I don't know why this wax doesn't want to, oh, there we go. You really do get the cookie note off of this. And you get the cotton candy. It's, It smells like it shouldn't, it sounds like it shouldn't work, but it actually works. I like it. It's just a really, really sweet cookie. Okay, I need to stop smelling this and let you guys know what Scentsy says about this fragrance. So, cotton candy cookie. It's a trip to the county fair, little hands clutching cotton candy and cookies while gooey treats topped with sugared raspberries beg to be tasted. Once again, long set description, but it works. So, I like it. And... I think after I warm this, I will decide if it's going to stay in my Scentsy Club. Right now, I think it will. I like it. It's it's so different, but I'm really, I think I'm really going to enjoy this one. Okay, the last one. The one I am most excited about. That is Candy Dandy. Now, I have heard that this is similar or kind of reminiscent of sugar. You guys already know how I feel about sugar. And you know it's coming back, right? You know sugar is coming back. It's It made bring back my bar. It's coming back. 
I'm excited. Okay, getting back to Easter. Candy dandy. I'm so excited. Let's see what it smells like. I love this so much. Oh my God. It really does remind you of sugar. Oh, this smells so good. It's a perfumey. It's a light perfumey scent. It really is reminiscent of sugar. It's like a toned down, more slightly powdery version of sugar. This is gorgeous. Scentsy Club worthy. I love this so much. This is everything. Mm. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Candy Dandy. Let's see what Scentsy says. Candy Dandy, almost sweet enough to eat. Kids will go gaga for this delicious candy scented concoction of mango, lemon drops, and creamy vanilla. I do not smell mango. You, you guys already know. We already talked earlier. I'm not the citrus girl. I don't smell the mango at all. I do smell like a creaminess. It's, it just smells like cotton candy, creamy cotton candy with a little hint of vanilla and a little, little splash of perfume, just a little, little, I, I, I want, I can't even talk. This is going in my Scentsy Club and it might not ever come out. Oh, I, I. Just get it. That's all I gotta say. Get it. If you do not pick up this collection for anything else, get it for, I can't even find it anymore. Get it for this. This is worth the entire three pack by itself. This right here. Candy dandy. It's everything. On a scale of 1 to 10, it's a 15. Get it. Just in case you haven't been on my Instagram, I wanted to share with you guys the top 25 cents that you guys voted for and I voted for that made it for Bring Back My Bar. Just in case you did not realize, here is the Instagram. And I'm going to go ahead and click on this post. Now, this is showing you... The top 25, the list dropped on Monday, letting you guys know what made it. So we have banana nut bread that made it. We have um, beach, beach daisy, blueberry rush. That was one of the ones I voted for. Blueberry rush made it. We have, I'm trying to read through the screen, cashmere, cherry lemonade, cherry limeade whoop wait a minute cherry limeade not cherry lemonade cherry cotton we have coconut cotton i've heard amazing things about that echo i've heard a lot of great things about that eucalyptus lord knows we all need some eucalyptus right now in this whole COVID 19 environment um we have fresh cut grass i'm really interested to see what that's about Fuzzy Blanket, I've heard that's a legendary scent, so I'm super excited for that. I did vote for that also. We have Grape Granita, I've heard great things about that. Happy Birthday, I voted for Happy Birthday. So happy that's back. Hemingway, heard amazing things about that. I think I did vote for that a few times. We have... Jumpin' Jelly Bean, I've heard some good things about that. Pink Haze. Okay, let's just stop. Let's let's just stop. So Pink Haze was leaving last year when I became a consultant. It had, well, I guess it had left. And it came back during a flash sale last year. That was when I got a chance to try Pink Haze and just fell in love with it and was like, 
why is this leaving? So super excited, it's back. Uh, we have Rio Beach, I've heard good things about that one too. Route 66, I've heard amazing things about that scent. I think my husband's gonna really like that. Uh, we have Simply Rose, I think I voted for that a few times. Southern Evening, that was another one I voted for. I was voting my heart out. Super excited that it is back. Sugar, thank you for those who listened and said, hey, vote for Sugar for me. What do you need? I'll vote for you. We, we brought Sugar back. And Sugar is going in my Scentsy Club and it is not coming out. Thunderstorm, another one I voted for like crazy. I have heard so many consultants that have been in the business, consultants and customers that have been fans of Scentsy forever talking about Thunderstorm. So I knew when we had this opportunity to bring it back, we had to vote for it. I am so excited it is coming back. I cannot wait to experience thunderstorm and white sands that's another one i've heard some great things about so i am super happy with this list and right now i'm looking like half of this list might be my scentsy club my scentsy club is about to explode so let me know if what you voted for made the list what you're excited about about that's on this list Share your thoughts. Was it something that you voted for that didn't make the cut? Let me know. Pretty much everything I was really voting like crazy for made it. Um, like I said, happy birthday, thunderstorm, sugar, southern evening, and um, blueberry rush. Those were the ones I was going hard in the paint for. So these will be out in June. I will have them the month before that. I don't have any specific dates on anything. I don't know when we as consultants are gonna get them. I don't know the date in June when this is gonna drop, but as soon as I have them, I will be doing a video and sharing them with you. But I did wanna let you know, because I know we have all invested a lot of time and energy in voting. So for those of you that didn't go to my Instagram and didn't see it, I wanted to bring it here and let you know what made it. So now it's time to go warm some Scentsy bars. So you know what? I think I'm just going to go ahead with the favorite of the day. We are going to warm Candy Dandy today and just get this party started right. So thank you for watching. As always, please remember to thumbs up, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, and I will see you in the next video.